In this video, you will learn about three different types of searches that we have at DOMCOP. Simple, advanced, and common. The simple search, as its name suggests, shows a search screen with a few settings that most users see. And use. The metrics at the top, like domain authority and trust flow, have sliders that make it easy to set them. Other metrics are grouped together in widgets. Each widget has a help icon at the top right, where you can get additional information on the contents of that widget. Let's go through each of these widgets right now. The industry widget lets you choose an industry based on the keywords in the domain name. This works well for domainers. However, if you are an SEO, the majestic topical category, which is available in the advanced search, works much better. The listing types widget lets you choose which type of domains you want to see, pending delete or auctions. Some auction sites like GoDaddy have specific terminology for certain auctions like bargain bin or counter offer. The domain extension widget lets you choose from .com, .net, .org, and other extensions. The same widget in the advanced search will let you pick from 70 plus individual extensions. The search widget lets you enter keywords that are matched in the domain name. You can also perform pattern matches to find domains with the specific names. The domain source widget lets you choose from specific domain sources. The advanced search version of this widget has a lot more sources, sources while the simple search version is limited to five top sources and one other source. Then guys, we have two miscellaneous widgets. The help icons are useful in figuring out what each of these checkboxes control. Once you have set the right parameters, you can click the search button and your domain table will refresh based on the set parameters. Let's move on to the advanced search right now by simply clicking on the advanced link at the top. You can see that the advanced search screen has so many widgets that they refuse to fit in a single screen. This screen has 13 widgets. Most widgets are based on a specific country. For example, all of Moz metrics can be set, set inside the Moz widget. Same goes with Majestic. Clicking the search button will refresh the domain table based on your advanced search setting. Much like the simple search, most DOMCOP customers use the advanced search screen for all their searches because this gives them like the maximum amount of control for the search parameters. The third type of search is the common searches. This is something we built for our new customers who are not sure what metrics to search on. Eventually, all customers graduate from the common search to the advanced search, but this is pretty useful when you're new. To access the common searches, you simply click the common link. You will notice a number of pre-built searches inside the dropdown. There are 12 pre-built searches that you guys can use. To execute any search, simply search the one you want from the dropdown and search will automatically be executed. Let's execute the GoDaddy expired domains, TF. You will notice that the next dropdown there will be information on what the search settings are. In this case, we are searching for domains that have GoDaddy as their source and have a trust flow of 15 or more. Feel free to try out all the other common searches. You don't need to sign up to execute any of the common searches, guys. Well, that's about it for searching at DOMCOP. Thank you so much for watching this video. Feel free to send us any questions you may have at support at domcop.com. And that's all I have for you today. Happy domain hunting!